What's up guys, Happy Droid here, back again with this thing. Sorry my my voice sounds a bit funny, I got a little bit of a, a scratchy throat this morning. Just finished my cup of candy, my brand new cup. Absolutely love this cup. I'm not going to tell you where to get it, but uh, yeah, that's my brand new cup. It makes me happy. <laughs> yeah, so yeah, just got done finishing this, put the, the clip back on. Uh, hot glued it in there so it doesn't yank out, you know, standard stuff. A little bit more hot glue to hold all this shit together so it doesn't fall apart uh, when it's been posted back. Yeah, that's what it is. It's, I basically got it back together, plugged in a brand new battery and just went the fuck over there and did some other stuff while this was uh, doing its thing. Basically what I wanted to do was test how long an alkaline battery would last in this. <coughs> In my, my opinion, this was such a big amplifier, I basically wanted to test how long this battery would last. And it didn't last very fucking long, unfortunately. After about 15 minutes, all I heard was uh, sort of like a, like a fucking scratching sound. It basically sounded like a little mouse behind a door scratching away. I immediately already knew the battery was fucking done and switched off, turned on the volume, switched it back on. It worked for a little bit and uh, the minute you turned up the volume it did it again so yeah already knew the battery was fucked 15 minutes is not a long time for a fucking ghost box to be running uh you barely even get a fucking session out of it i don't know who who has these things if you have better battery life maybe it's just this one i don't fucking know uh but certainly i think that this big massive uh amplifier is probably what's causing it Basically, the minute I turn up any kind of decent volume, it's quiet as it is, but the minute I, you know, try to get any decent kind of volume in it, whoosh, makes a whole, a whole bunch of fucking sound. I ain't impressed with it one little bit. Um, So I'm going to show you guys what it sounds like. <clears throat> I've got Jerry up to a little 3.7 volt battery with a butt converter. That butt converter puts out about 500 milliwatts, so it's still not enough to run this circuit, which actually surprised me. So that's what it sounds like. That's about as much volume I can get out before it starts making a scratchy sound. Turn up a little bit more. If I put my finger on the antenna, it gets a little bit louder. And then it does that fucking shit. Absolutely fucking annoying. Yeah, it ain't good. This thing puts out 500 milliamp, so I'm guessing this circuit is probably in the region between 1 and fucking 1.5 and amps. Probably more than that. I'd have to check the, the amp draw of this uh, amplifier to get a correct figure. But I was calculating amps between all these components because I already don't know how, how many amps this pulls. already don't know how many amps this pulls. And with the T5767 module connected to there, you know... <coughs> It's a lot of shit to be running from 9 volts, if you ask me. Definitely a better power supply would be much more beneficial. You would get way more runtime from it. Probably like a, a 7.2 volt battery would probably run this directly without any kind of fucking modifications. And yeah, just have a little fucking charger for it. You know, it would probably still fit inside the little fucking 9 volt battery tray. Um, yeah, there's other ways to power this. I certainly wouldn't power all this with a... 9 volt battery, especially if you're only going to get about 15 20 minutes at a push. I guarantee you, it wasn't even 20 minutes. 15 minutes is starts sounding like a little fucking mouse scratching at a door. Not impressed at all. Um, yeah, I was impressed with the kind of build quality. Of this is that is all kind of fair. I did kind of guess that the battery life would be short. I didn't think it was going to be fucking 15 20 minutes short. I thought this would run that for about an hour because these batteries are about sort of about. You know, they're about 600, 650 milliamp hour. I'm not 100% sure about this brand, but typically with a 9 volt cell, you get about 550, 600 milliamp hour. So, yeah, that would have run something, uh, you know, I thought this circuit would have been about sort of about half, half a milliamp. <clears throat> it's clearly not running that because this lasted way shorter than I thought. Um so yeah if you're if you're kind of savvy with the capacity, uh arm draws and all this kind of thing, you you would already have figured out that this uh was a bad idea. 
And, uh, yeah, this guy is supposed to mean to be a fucking electrician, blah, blah, blah. You would already known about Ohm's Law, fucking capacity, arm draws, and clearly you don't. Anywho, I'm going to leave it there because I'm fed up with the side of this. I'm going, I'm going to want to launch out the fucking window. I'm just basically going to put it back together the way it is. The customer asked me to put a clip on. I put a clip on, leaned up a little bit. That's all I'm going to do to it. Ain't going to fuck about with it anymore. Uh, the sweep is also the wrong way around as well. Uh, you turn it that way. I would have expected the sweep to get faster, but no. You turn it left and it gets faster. Yeah, it's back to front in my opinion, but that's, that's just me nitpicking. Uh, yeah, not impressed with it. Not impressed at fucking tall. If you're going to get fucking 15, 20 minutes run time out of it, I wouldn't even bother. Um, yeah, a lot of things to I would address with that. I'm I'm not even gonna go into fucking depth. Uh yeah, but it ain't fucking loud. It ain't that loud at all. I thought I was gonna be much louder with that with this big uh, uh speaker. This is a two watt speaker. Not sure what the fuck this is. I'm gonna to have to check this out and basically see if there's another replacement. Maybe I can say to the customer, you want another amplifier here because this ain't fucking good. Uh, yeah, so yeah, I'm gonna leave there, guys. I'm gonna catch you guys in the next one. Not impressed at all. Uh, yeah, if, if you want your ghost box to run 15 20 minutes, by all means, uh, go right ahead. I ain't impressed with that whatsoever, just in my opinion. Okay, bye then out.